day four post fall update um i've had quite a few people asking me like am i okay um how do i feel uh how's the healing going etc right um i think so far so good um like i said i haven't broken anything um to my knowledge um my body still hurts though like i know that my muscles hurt i've been trying to um massage the the pain away essentially um bought this nifty massage gun from this girl in taipei you will hear that in the story a bunch of times because that's where i buy my stuff um and yeah the finger looks better i will insert a picture of it before um and this is the after cannot really see it well um I was trying to put this camera around. It will not let me. Um, I will take a picture after this and insert it. Um, I can sort of bend it. It's I've had a wrap around. If you can see the, the tape marks a bit. I don't want to scrub this finger too much. Because um, I'm a bit I'm a bit worried. So um, I can bend it. Right. But the full motion is still kind of. I don't know. It's just very stiff. Um, it doesn't hurt for me to bend it. Um, and I'm not sure if this finger is ever really going to, uh, be the same, even once it grows back. I don't know. Um, the knee, I will also insert picture here. And I have a, a bunch of other um, random bruises and abrasions that I'm I'm noticing now because they are scabbed over. Um, and yeah, that's really it. Like other than my body hurting, like I can walk normal. I still can't do stairs. Um, I just noticed the, the full bending of coming down a stair and up a stair is just my knee is like angry. Like because my knee, once you see the pictures, you will see the bruise. There's a bruise on my kneecap. Um, I don't think it's fractured, though, because it's not swollen anymore. Mm -hmm. um, but there is a bruise there and my flexing it like that, it it bothers it. So uh, I've just been taking the elevator. Um, I didn't do any exercise this week. Uh, I've just been walking. Like, walking is fine. Like, on flat surfaces, um, up small, small inclines is okay. Um, and it doesn't hurt. But, yeah, I noticed on steps and stairs and things like that, mm, my body is like, no. Nah, can we not? Can we avoid this? Um, yeah, so that's really it. Um, next step is contacting the police station. I don't know. I'm getting a lot of mixed messages so I've, I've just asked um other foreigners in taiwan like if they have any um advice on what i should do next yada yada like this um and of course there are certain types of people that are like you're ungrateful you didn't die did you like so i'm just supposed to leave this hole open or what so it doesn't matter that somebody else can fall in. How selfish of you rather than making this my fault. Because I think, um, and I will do another video about this. There are certain types of foreigners, like foreigner groups that usually tend to go to places in Asia. Um, and unfortunately, those super pessimistic, super like... People like who you, you have to ask like who hurt you kind of people. They also move to Asia and then they take out all their frustrations here rather than at home. Um, and it's really sad because this situation um, to me is quite serious and also to other people is also quite serious. Um, and even for my friends who were with me, it was also traumatic for them. Like they're still talking about how scared they were 
um, seeing you just disappear like that. Um, and then other people are like, you're fine. You can walk, right? And do I have to break a bone for it to be serious to y'all? Do I have to die? Do I have to be hospitalized? It's still serious. And it's just, it's really interesting to me um, how people react. Um, and I also think that me being a woman has something to do with it because it was only men who reacted that way. Um, it hasn't been any women. Most women are like, oh my gosh, are you okay? Like, you know, in a real concerned manner. And it wasn't all of the men that responded like that, but the ones who have the overwhelming, like, you're fine kind of like attitude are men in my experience. And it's really sad. Um, but anyway, that's my update for day four, um, post fall. And, uh, once I do, I don't know, police report or whatever I have to do, I will do another update.